What's up people, it's the J-Dog here and this is Crypto Shots. In this episode I'm going to be teaching you how to download the Hashpack wallet and this is used to connect the different exchanges on Hedra to buy different NFTs. So let's get started. So, as you know from previous videos, I do all my stuff on Brave but we'll do it on Chrome because I haven't got it on there. So, first thing we'll do is type in Hashpack That'll be the first one, www.hashpack.app. Click on that. Install on Chrome. Add to Chrome. Add extension. Click off there. So now we can click on the jigsaw piece, pin it. Click here. Create a password. Create the terms and conditions. Next. Create new wallet. Create your wallet. So the first thing it'll do is give you all your seed phrases, like every other wallet. These are really important. You need to make sure you save these in a, in a safe place. So copy them. And then we'll open a Word document. Save them in here. And then from there, once you've copied it, next. Now you've got your seed phrases saved. So you just put them in here. Number four, four. Number nine. Number 10, number 11, finally number 23, give you what a nickname, now it's creating the wallet. And this is your account ID here, so you want to save that as well. You also would want to save your password in here as well. And then what I would do is I would save this document on an external hard drive um, and then also handwrite it into a password book and then I'll delete this off your off your computer. Obviously this is only a practice wallet so it's going to be getting deleted anyways. Save the information. Let's go. So now the wallet's set up here. So you've got your Hashpack wallet set up now. And if you want to send HBAR to this wallet, you need to just copy this. This is your wallet address here. So you copy this information. So say if you're on an exchange like, I don't know, Binance for example. Um, you go and send HBAR and then this would be the address that you'd send it to and then your HBAR will appear here and the HBAR moves really fast so it's basically instant and the fees are negligible like a fraction of a cent so it's really good really fast wallet and then once you've got your HBAR you can use that to connect to different um, websites different exchanges within HBAR and then purchase one of the NFTs that you want and then what will happen is the NFTs will appear here. But what's different is from, you know, like Sol and Binance and stuff like that, when you buy NFTs, with HBOR you first got to associate the NFT. So to do that, you'd put in the details here. That's connected to the NFT before you send it. 
you'd associate it and then after that once it's been associated then you send it to your Hatchpack wallet here so that's it for this episode we'll be doing more tutorials we're deep diving into other projects and stuff coming up on the next few episodes so hit the subscribe button if you want to see more give it a like that's it